Hello everyone, so for today's video I'm going to be unboxing some mystery boxes as my friend George has started his own mystery box kind of business and it's called Hype Beast Mystery Boxes so I'll leave a link to the Instagram and everything in the description if you want to check it out. They sell loads of different types of boxes with different price ranges so they sell £50, £100 and £150 ones all the way up to the higher end of boxes around like £10,000. So um, they've sent me a £150 box and a £250 box for me to open for you and then I've also got some examples of the higher end ones to open. Yeah, they're basically filled with, you know, hype beast stuff. I don't really know what is going to be in them but um, if you want to purchase one of them and get some amazing hype beast goods then um, click the link in the description and check them out. So here we have the first box. This one is a £150 box. It's going to run First off, we have a Supreme headband. Uh, these are worth about 40 quid. How are you supposed to wear yeah, it? <laughs> so um, you can maybe go skiing with this on or something. Then we have some Vetement socks. These are tiny white with um, black stripes. These are about 50 quid, very expensive, very bougie on the feet. So next we have this Supreme jersey, which was worn by Rihanna in the Fashion Killer video. This is worth about 50 quid as well. Here we have a Charlotte's jersey, worn by the Baby on the Bop on Broadway video. Very nice teal colour champion. Um, this is worth about 30 quid. So the box is worth about 170 altogether so um, very good value for money if you're into your hype beast garms. This is the weirdest thing I've ever <laughs> I have no idea what I'm <laughs> Next we have the £250 box. Um, so the first thing in here is these off-white vapour streets. Very jazzy. These are worth about £140 so that's quite a big chunk of the box already in value. What else should I say about them? Tidy, <laughs> Fucking tidy, like, look at them. I like the new design with the, uh, <laughs> with the lace up and... The laces, um, very new, unique pair of shoes. Everyone, you'll be walking down the street and everyone will be like, Ooh, look at those shoes. Then next we have some Bape socks. These are worth about 40 quid, um, very nice. <laughs> <Bougie on> the <thing. laughs> and then finally we have this supreme t-shirt probably worth around 100 quid size large just with the supreme logo there very nice so overall worth about 280 for the 250 box <laughs> get your hands on them. so here is the t-shirt on obviously i wouldn't really wear it with this but um very nice very oversized and then here we have the shoes and the socks very pleased. <laughs> I am so <laughs> I am so pleased. Give you a nice pan down of the uh, feet. Tell me your opinions in the comments because George says there's very mixed opinions on these shoes. Now let's move on to the high end boxes. So here we have all the £10,000 boxes. How do people know what to say? Like the one I watched, she was saying so much about yeah. each item. I'm like, what do you say? So all together it's 10,000, they've just come in oh, different right, boxes, okay. so we're just saying So the all together, all the four boxes I just showed you add to £10,000. First up we have the off-white Caravaggio hoodie, very fresh, very um, crisp. This is worth about 350 Oh, that's really good. <laughs> 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 it's the back. Classic off-white, everyone will know that you're rich when you're in this. Let me know if you like these uh, hype beast videos. <laughs> See a few more in the future from my good pals at Hype Beast Mystery <laughs> Next up, we have this Bape X Adidas collab jersey with the nice camo design and the original lo logo. Yeah, yeah. Logo. Uh, here's the back. This one's worth about 150. Um, then next up, we have these Bape Converse. These will go extremely well with the last item I just showed you, as they are. Are they the same or different? Yeah, the same. As they're the same camo design. These are worth about 200. Really like these. I actually really like these. I would wear these myself, so I'm sure a lot of you guys would wear them if you have similar fashion style to me. Talking of Converse, here we have another pair. These ones are off-white. Uh, these are the off-white Converse X Nike Chuck Taylors, and they have the 
orange thing on them. Very nice again, I would wear these. These ones are a bit more expensive, about £450. We'll pretty much go with anything because they're white. Next up, we have an off-white black t-shirt, but um, sensible in the front part in the back because because <laughs> it's um, like this on the back. This is worth about £250, probably similar size to this one. I definitely rep this on the town. <laughs> I'm not leaving that in. <laughs> Next up we have the Yeezy 350 Statics. <clears throat> You've probably seen these before. Every hype beast owns a pair of Yeezys. They're worth around £650, so quite expensive. Um, <laughs> I, I would rep them. <laughs> now for the second box. So the first thing in the second box is a Juventus X EA Sports jersey. This one's a bit more feminine, a bit more pink and pastel. It'd be great for a festival, um, obviously Corona is about. There's always next year to rep your hypebeast clobber. So this is worth about £100. Next up we have a bit of Gucci. I have some Gucci joggers. These are worth about £750, so quite expensive. Um, just have Gucci down the side and they're cuffed like that at the bottom. <laughs> I'd certainly invest in these kind of things because they're very um, unique and trendy at the same time. Next up we have the off-white waterfall t-shirt. Um, very nice design on the front and then similar to the other one I showed you on the back. This is worth about 250 What does it say on the back? Looks like this subscribe one. Subscribe to Sadie Rose. It says subscribe to Sadie Rose on the back. I like how the, all these t-shirts are oversized so you could either tuck them in or tie them or you could just wear them loose um, if you wanted to. You could wear it as a t-shirt dress if you were small enough. Next up we have this Bape basketball jersey. About 100 quid. Very nice colour. Has the Bape across the front with the... Um, is it monkey? Yeah. With the <laughs> Oh shit. <laughs> with the ape on the front, uh, just playing on the back. Very good for summer, very airy, again, nice for festival. Pray for wireless. <laughs> Serious. Crapage. Um, serious what, sorry? Crapage. <laughs> serious crepage. So next up we have some serious crepage, as George would like to say. Some Jordan 11s. Jordan 11 Concords with this shiny black on the um, bottom with uh, just white and the soles are blue and whatever colour that is. These are worth about 260 Get yourself a pair, they're very nice. And next up we have these Jordan 1s in a sort of like turquoisey colour. The guys at Hype Beast Mystery Box have um, swapped the laces so one's a darker blue and one's white. I think this adds a very more cool and unique look to the shoe. Um, so if you're about that then maybe look into purchasing some. These are 300 £310, very cool, really like Jordan ones, so that's box number two. Okay, so up next we have the third box, and this is very Travis Scott themed. themed. As you know, I'm a very big fan of Travis <laughs> Scott, no I'm not. So first we have, we have a Nike X highest in the room Travis Scott hoodie, love the colour on this, very bright. Has an upside down Nike Air on the front, and then on the back, Cactus Jack on the back. Very interesting hoodie. This one's about 150 to 200 pounds. Very unique. I really like this. Fire it on, Sadie. Yeah. St stick it on. Reminds me of DHL, I don't know. This is what the uh, hoodie looks like. Next, we have an Astro World Travis Scott t shirt. This is in a more grey colour. Don't know why I said a more grey colour. <laughs> <laughs> what compared to this? <laughs> this one's grey. And on the back it says, Wish you were here. Because I wish you were here. <laughs> uh, just has Astro World on the front. The picture is of skull with the world on its head. <laughs> this one's about 50 quid. Next we have the Air Force One Cactus Jacks. I've forgotten everything you just said. I actually do got I really yeah. like these. They're really uh, they go with the hoodie really nicely because of the uh, mustard. Very interesting compared to the normal white ones that every white girl wears. These are around £450. Different textures on the uh, shoe. Really like all the Travis Scott Nike Air Force Ones. Very interesting, very different. Talking of Travis Scott Air Force Ones. Talking of Travis Scott Air Force One. Here we have the big boys. These are expensive. How much is them? £1,000. These are £1,000. Uh, you can take the like ticks off and put different ones on. Oh. 
These ones have changeable ticks because they're Velcro, so you can take them off. They come with different ticks, what did you Yeah, add? they come with different ticks. They come with different ticks, but um, these are the ones that are on them. And then that's the tick on the other side. Cool. Then there's some um, grills on the front. If the channel hits a million subscribers, then these are the type of shoes that I'll be wearing because I'll be um, raking it in. So Then next we have a Supreme man bag or girl bag in that matter. Uh, this is about £100 and just has the Supreme on the strap and then again, good for a festival. <laughs> be sensible. <laughs> <laughs> so we're now on to the last box. First we have a Balenciaga hat. About 300 about 300 very expensive. Nice cherry red colour. Um, good for your holiday. Again, could be cancelled, but always keep your hopes up. Nike X Cactus Plant Flea Market. <laughs> well, let me just say it first. Nike X Cactus Plant Flea Market. Yeah. Next, we have a Nike X Cactus Plant Flea Market. What is this? It looks like a hockey jersey. Like a hockey jersey. I actually really like this. It's very cool. Um, the front looks like this with the yellow and the black writing. And then on the back it says Air Sunshine. £250. Um, has a bit of mesh on it. It looks like it's really thick but it's quite airy at the same time because of the mesh. Yeah. Next we have a vape camo t-shirt. Again, like the vape camo. We've had a few in the collection so far. It has the back of the head there and then the ape at the front. About £100-£250 this one. They're so ugly. Car. Very retro. Next we have the Nike X Zakai waffles. I thought they were ugly but they're quite retro looking. These are about £300-£350. Very interesting shoe because of the um the uh, sole. There's a double collar. Collar? Yeah, tongue. 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 There's a double tongue under here, if you like that. <laughs> <laughs> They're very unique. I've never seen these before, so um, that's the, the good thing about um, Hypebeast mystery boxes because they supply very unique Hypebeast clothing that you may not have never seen before. So go check them out. Now we have the most expensive pair of trainers I've ever held in my hands. Nike X Off-White Jordan 1 Chicago's look like this. Classic kind of colour scheme, red and white and black. I really like Jordans. If you're willing to buy one of these more expensive high-end boxes, then these are the kind of things that you may find inside, which is obviously very exciting because they're so expensive and they're really rare. And this is in fact the last item. I'm going to now put on a few of my favourite items and give you a little fashion show of some of the stuff that you could get in a hype beast mystery box. This is the Nike X CPFM hockey jersey on. Obviously it's more of a men's fit but still quite nice. Like that on the back. And then we have the holy grail grails on the feet. This is what they look like for anyone wondering what they look like on. And then obviously still got the babe socks on as well. And this is the aftermath of um, the unboxing and there's George who's been helping me throughout the whole video because I have no idea what I'm talking about. That is the end of the video. If you like what you saw and want to purchase something like this then go and check them out on Instagram and Depop. I will leave it on the screen and in the description. Thank you to George and his brothers for letting me film this video and see you in the next one. Bye!